Top of the morning to you guys. Welcome to your Tuesday morning market brief. US markets were pretty much dead flat uh, on Monday. They really closed. Uh, Dow was ever so slightly higher. S&P and NASDAQ were down ever so slightly. So we'll call it flat for the day. Oil was back above $90 a barrel. So there was no significant economic data news, no central bank news, no commentary from anyone that really uh, was uh, driving markets on Monday. There was a bit of news out of the chip maker NVIDIA in the US that released their earnings when it came in weaker than expected. That sort of dragged on the market down a little bit. NVIDIA was down about uh, 8%. Boeing, though, was up 3% after the uh, aircraft manufacturer was giving approval to start uh, deliveries of its 787 Dreamliner again. So that was good news for the market. Um, inflation in the US, we're going to get some news out on Wednesday regarding the latest inflation report, but a consumer inflation report says that consumers are expecting inflation to be about 6.2% for the next 12 months, so much, much higher than where the US Fed wants it to be. Um, back to our down under, the Aussie dollar trading at about 69.80, hasn't really moved much in the last couple of trading sessions. Uh, the 10-year US Treasury yield about 2.7%. As I said, oil back above $90 a barrel. On the local front, uh, Oz Minerals rejected a takeover bid from BHP for about $8.4 billion. They said, no, thank you very much. But Veolia uh, over in Europe is in talks with Macquarie Bank to sell its UK waste business to the Australian Investment Bank. So we own Macquarie. It's been a great investment for us. And uh, I suspect that uh, that deal will likely go through. That's your Monday market brief for the US, Tuesday market brief for Australia. Have a great day. See you tomorrow.